This is Matthew Robert Payne and uh, uh, this is a prophecy for Joanna and uh, I want to thank uh, your family personally uh, for the donation. Um, it really uh, is helping with a couple of expenses that I really needed and um, even 15 minutes before uh, you sent the donation through I was thinking how I needed an extra $120 um, and how hoping God would supply that to me and uh, he came through with your donation and um, and that's just amazing that uh, I read a scripture uh, today before you ask I will answer and uh, it seems that I hadn't even asked the Lord and he answered my prayer so I pray I pray um, for for Joanna now um, so dear father I pray that you give me a word for Joanna a word to bless her and encourage her and uh, inspire her on her journey in Jesus name Amen um, there's a book uh, called seeing in the spirit made simple is uh, written by praying medic um, P-R-A-Y-I-N-G, Medic, M-E-D-I-C. Um, that's a book um, that uh, I highly recommend um, you uh, reading and, uh, and going through the exercises uh, to practice uh, seeing in the spirit. Um, as I was preparing my copy before, thinking about you, um, I just got... Uh, the message of the Lord that you called to be a seer and um, uh, a seer is a, a prophet uh, who can see uh, see in the supernatural realm so they have a lot of dreams and they have a lot of visions and can see the supernatural um, a lot of people have pride when they tell people that they're a seer they, they seem to be puffed up with pride as though it's special well, praying medic in his book says that everyone can see, and you don't have to be a seer uh, to uh, to see in the spirit. Just as you don't have to be a prophet to prophesy, um, the gift of prophecy is available to everyone. So, his book is uh, an amazing book, and I've read it, and uh, I highly recommend it. And uh, even on the front page of Amazon, you'll see a review I've written of it. And um, if you uh, type in "seeing in the spirit made simple" on YouTube, you'll see a review that I did on the book. So I really encourage you in that. I feel that um, heaven wants to open up and uh, Jesus wants to uh, introduce you to his angels he wants to speak to you and appear to you in person uh, he wants to bring you to heaven and instruct you he wants you to meet his father in heaven um, he's got a whole host of uh, and it's a whole host he's got a whole host of saints that he wants to introduce you to and uh, talk to and dialogue with um, it, it, it's just uh, an amazing supernatural journey that uh, he wants you to uh, walk in and it wants to open wide up and um, I feel that uh, I'd get that information uh, for you in this prophetic word um, simply because uh, that may be a desire of your heart that that's what you want to walk in so that book um, is uh, a book that I suggest you read and it's got good exercises in to open you up to that realm if you're not already operating in that realm um, I operate in that realm but even the book was uh, good for me to read to see what was possible so I pray that you uh, can uh, buy that book and read that book and write him a review uh, too when you finish and doing him a favour and recommend the book to other people. Um, I feel that um, there's a scripture, John 14:12, I think it is. Um, I'll just uh, look it up. Um, always have my Bible next to me when I do a prophecy. John 14:12. It says, most assuredly I say to you, he who believes in me, the works that I do, he will do also. And greater works than these he will do, because I go to my Father. Um, 
I feel that that's a verse that's special to you. Um, the fact that the Holy Spirit brought it up to me, um, uh, I feel uh, it's a verse that you've thought about and meditated about and wondered in yourself, is that possible? Uh, could I possibly uh, do greater works than Jesus? And um, I, I've got an article uh, that I wrote uh, that uh, 33,000 people have read. And um, that's an example of doing a greater work uh, than Jesus. You know, Jesus' words uh, are read by uh, millions of people uh, and billions of people now. But uh, the disciples recorded them, but Jesus didn't actually write a book. And, uh, and um, so you can do uh, things, you know, um, my articles on, on uh, the internet have been read by three quarters of a million people and that's an example of a greater work. Um, Jesus hadn't reached three quarters of a million people with um, his message um, uh, when he lived and so there, there's simple things you can do but um, there's greater miracles and there's greater things and I feel that uh, you've pondered uh, that scripture and said in your heart is that possible um, you've got this um, real uh, childlike faith um, you've, you've got this uh, real simple innocent faith that you have for the things of God and uh, you believe that um, you're worthy and you believe that um, that uh, God would use you and uh, you've got this uh, real simple faith that says I wonder I wonder could I do this and I wonder could I do that um, Jesus uh, wants to appear to you he wants to talk to you he wants to bring you to heaven he wants to train you to be a general uh, in the Lord's army uh, he wants to uh, commission you and uh, and uh, anoint you and uh, uh, give you anointings and mantles that uh, will carry you forth with authority and he wants to raise you up as a prophet and a seer uh, to be a messenger and uh, to bring his message and um, he, you and your husband he wants to uh, use you to be spiritual mothers and fathers but I can see um, hundreds of people uh, and in the future thousands of people um, marching to your steps and marching uh, to your direction and oversight. Um, I feel um, words, are, uh, words can be misread but I feel that um, you've got an apostolic uh, calling on your life. I could uh, easily see you um, being an apostle and um, managing five churches or or more and um, I could feel you see you being a senior pastor and a senior prophet uh, part of, a, of one church and overseeing four other churches um, I it, it's um, when Jesus uh, talked about something the disciples said well that seems impossible and um, Jesus said that's impossible for man but uh, with God all things are possible and I feel that um, that uh, God wants you to know uh, that um, he can do exceedingly and abundantly more than you can even uh, think um, it says um, now to him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we ask or think according to the power that works within us. I feel that um, God is going to be able to um, do exceedingly and abundantly more than uh, you can even believe or, or conceive. Um, I feel that um, you can't even imagine you can't even get your head around what God is going to do through you and your husband. Um, I feel that uh, you've got a tremendous anointing on your life and, uh, and the Lord is going to continue to anoint you and raise you up and train you. Um, there's a book um, 
uh, that I wrote, The Prophetic Supernatural Experience, and uh, that's a book on the prophetic and what it's like to be a prophet. Um, and uh, I've got a couple of chapters in there about seeing angels and seeing Jesus, and uh, it certainly be a book that be encouraging for you to read. Uh, it'll give you some insight about the prophetic office. I can't really suggest the book on the apostolic, but there's good books around. Um, I, I feel that uh, you should have heard uh, that you're called to be a prophet and a seer um, before, um, but uh, as a prophet, sometimes I'm the first one to say it to a person. Um, so I see that in you. I see uh, tremendous potential in you. I can see you overseeing many churches. I can see uh, you and your husband being a father and a mother uh, to many people. I can see you leading an army. Um, God sees you as one of his generals. Uh, in the Jewish army, the general used to fight on the front line or still does uh, go to the front line and leads from the front. He doesn't lead in a protected uh, barracks up the front of uh, the back of the war in a control room, but the general actually goes to the front line and fights. So um, I can see you being a Jewish general in this uh, upcoming war in the last days. So. I pray uh, that this uh, really encourages you and uh, you can write to me and give some feedback. God bless.